DataSkill is a company that's been around for 37 years, highly specialized in innovation and integration of technologies. Five years ago, we made a decision to bet the company, our future, on cognitive computing and uh, artificial intelligence technologies. So Akumi is our IP, our product, that works with IBM products to deliver you know, uh, stellar results, uh, innovative results in text analytics, machine learning, and IoT. So Watson is inside of Akumi, and we use so many other products from IBM that are the engines inside. We've developed a model for a mental health facility to be able to predict clinical aggression in mentally ill patients. In about two months, we sat down with the clinicians and the physicians, with IBM, of course we got our, our, our things from Ingram, and we brought the Akumi solution to bear to deliver a clinical aggression model in healthcare that allows doctors to know in a thousand patient bed environment which six to nine patients are likely to act out that day. International trade, as you can imagine, is a pretty intense environment. It's highly regulated. You've got shippers all over the world, including the Middle East, manifests, you know, bills of lading, you know, ports of call. Um, all of these things have to be validated and cross-validated, not only for security, but for efficiency reasons, right? So we developed a trade finance solution using intelligence and data analytics to look at the unstructured data and make sure they align with rules and regulations, to make sure they align with the banking standard policy so they can differentiate themselves. How is cognitive computing going to influence the future of data skill. We get excited about a use case, like a world speed record, or you know, a disease diagnosis, and we should be excited about that too. But more generally speaking, why we do what we do is to elevate the human condition. So that's the end game.